The first thing they were here before comparing the current results with a poll conducted by the University of Monmouth in August 2016. The likely position of Biden as a voter is similar to Clinton's position in Swain counties in the summer, where they gained 5,040%, said the University of Monmouth in a statement. Shepard said Biden's current leadership in Trump is so great more than 8 percentage points on the national average and 3 or more points in Arizona, Florida, Michigan, Pennsylvania and Wisconsin that the 2006 polling error does not matter. If Trump voters are embarrassed, it can be assumed that social stigma can be the cause of embarrassment when a voter asks which candidate they support. In a 913 July survey of 401 registered voters in Keystone, 53 supported Biden and 40 supported President Trump. The existence of a shy winner remains controversial. Four years after the incumbent had experienced the biggest political upheavals of recent times. If he does not live in a state where elections are disputed, especially in deep blue states such as New York, California or Washington and psychologically does not want to consider himself that person. There is no reason to vote for Trump, even if his election is secret. Will the secret ballot lead to an amazing result in the state of Pennsylvania in November? Many Pennsylvanians think so, according to the new poll. It is interesting to note that Trump is a little better in major Clinton constituencies today than four years ago when he voted for Clinton from 21 to 67. The Democrat has its roots in the region, which may help him, but there seems to be a general erosion of Trump's support compared to 2016. Said in a press release, Patrick Murray, director of the University of Monmouth Survey Institute. It should also be noted that despite the belief of Pennsylvania is in the realm of shy and triumphant voters, the state is unlikely to resist this time. Independent voters, who are likely to exert any pressure Trump might exert to defeat Pennsylvania, preferred Biden with 5,443. However, in states such as Wisconsin, Michigan, North Carolina, and Florida, a shy winner can play an important role, especially if numbers start to fall. A survey of the University of Monmouth, released on Wednesday, showed that former Vice President Joe Biden is 13 points ahead of Trump.